Hello, welcome back. This is Kenshin1913, and we are Let's Play Chrono from Dark Lord, Episode 1, Tides of Fate. In the last episode, we made it through the majority more of the Abyss. And now, we have to fight a boss. And who's this boss? It's... It's Alpha Guardian. Let's see if you're weak against me. Yeah, you are. You are very weak. Let's see if you're weak against this. And let's see if you're weak against this. That was fairly powerful. Dragonic male, that is great. Uh, you know what? It's not that much worse. I'll, I'll, I'll hold, I'm gonna obviously hold on to it. All right, so we had Alpha and Omega, or Beta, or whatever. Booyah, kasha. Oh, yeah. That was some nice damage. Look at that. We are kicking ass. Running over to the next floor. I see oblivion. Please don't kill me. Look at the set. Right. Let's use this. Hello? Yes. Yeah. I don't know, like about an hour ago now, I think. Yeah. Alright. I don't know. Alrighty. Yeah, all right. That one I'm not leaving. Okay. Oh, here we are. Come on. There we go, you're dead! 
final uh, thing. Oh, we can. Ah, interesting. We can warp right back to the the, the uh, Fey realm. That's good to know. Cause I want to go back there after we're done here. Any items? Nope, just cat guy. Hey, cat guy. My choices lead me here, and I am thankful, actually. You shall pay dearly. You shall not stand in my master. Blah, blah, blah. Get the sound of your death rapidly approaching. Look at that. No fancy schmancy speech, just death. Phoenix Tears. The war has just begun. So now that we beat Anto Callius, let us head back to the Fey Realm. Yes, we're going all the way back. And now that we got that Dark Dragonus Blade, we can actually get our secret character, who's not really that secret. But it's a secret character nonetheless. So if we come up here, we can look at this thing. And I don't know who this lady is, but she's the finest fae that ever lived. Tell me, what is it you wish and I shall grant it? And now we can take one million dollars. 
One million dollars. <laughs> or Maze's beloved one. Uh, yeah, I guess so. So we need a certain blade for this to happen, and we already beat the boss there, so we get it now. And who do they warp to us but... None other but... Galena, yes. There and now she's here. Yes. Yes, so we got Galena Gray back. Which is nice, I guess. Although I was expecting someone else, but that's cool. And now actually she's probably the th like third best party member behind Zeria. Sorry, uh Blondie, but we're gonna put Galena in. She's just better. Sorry. And the reason why she's better, let's do this, and then put you here. The reason why she's better is because she, yeah, it's been forever since we've had it, huh? And yeah, here's her weapon, very good. So I gave her the best stuff she can have, basically. And yeah, I'll give her that. Anyways, let's see something here. She learns a bunch of spells, but the thing that she gets is an ability at level 40, I think it is. Um, sh she can uh, actually turn into a dragon, right? Because she is a dark dragoness, apparently. And she can, so they're in love with a dragon, which is fine. I've seen it in other games. Uh, but yeah, so after you've done that, I think we can go over here, and I want to say there's a uh, there's a bonus dungeon. Oh yeah, also Galena, she has uh, 400 MP. Well, let's make that, let's change that a little bit. Where are we here? Cause she'll actually, she actually gets an ability that, that uses 100 MP, so, and it's friggin' amazing. And I'm just gonna use this, and this. There we go. Yeah, she gets an ability that uh, uses 100 MP, so it's worth it to give her that. But after we do all that stuff, we come up over here. There's a little tier thingy here. But what I'm actually going to do is uh, I'll probably go back to the Abyss and fight around a little bit and get Galena up to level 40 or so. I, I'm thinking I'm going to get everyone up to... I'll probably get her up to like 45 before I even consider doing the next part because we'll go into the bonus dungeon uh, because I'd rather get I want to get that out of the way before I uh, <clears throat> before uh, everything so yeah um, and I won't turn Galena into a dragon when you do that she permanently becomes a dragon hell you know what I'm gonna buy one of them a you know what while we're here might as well do a little shopping right I'm gonna purchase some of those uh, some of them items Mainly the MP ones give Galena one more, and then I'll probably just, uh, yeah, maybe I'll get them for Magus too, huh? That way that I can just constantly use, uh, I can constantly use those, uh, abilities. Get out of the way, cheaper, where the hell you are. Alright, so if we come over here, we're gonna purchase three of these, and then the rest of those. And we're gonna give these. One is going to Galena. Two are going to Magus. Now these are gonna to go to you. And then I think Galena's HP will actually go up a lot, but if not, I will uh, purchase her some of those. So yeah, uh, I th now that we're all decked out magically, I think I will. Uh, <coughs> I think I will end the episode here. And then the next episode. Can she be equipped with earrings? No. So she can never even equip that, this item here. Oh well. Anyways, in the next episode, we will con we will go to the bonus dungeon and uh, do as much as I can there, and then I will probably go and beat the game. So this has been Kenshin1913, and I'll see you later. Bye bye